No more diets in 2021. Stop trying to lose weight by doing things that you cannot do forever. Keep on watching and I'm gonna help you lose weight for the very last time. Hi everybody, it's Sylvester the Weight Loss King and welcome back to the channel and thank you for being part of my channel. For those that are new here today, my name is Sylvester the Weight Loss King. 18 years ago, I lost 80 kilos, which is about 190 pounds. But the most important part is that I've been able to keep it all off for 18 years. So today is all about avoiding any diets in 20. 21. <laughs> losing weight for the very last time takes a different approach from losing weight. So losing weight is very easy, but keeping the weight off, which I'm all about, requires a different approach and that's where the magic happens. Stop trying to lose weight by doing things that you can't do forever and start to fall in love with the lifestyle that you're going to adapt for the rest of your life. Those last two sentences really summarizes how I've been able to keep the weight off for 18 years. Stop trying to lose weight by doing things that you can't do forever and start to fall in love with the lifestyle that you're going to adapt for the rest of your life. And yes, I've had my challenges, temptations, but really, I this time around, after trying many, many diets for about 20 years, I took a different approach because I made a promise to myself. This time, the way I would start to lose weight is the way I was going to adapt for the rest of my life. So what diets do? All diets work. They give you the weight loss that you're looking for. Being a three day detox program, to a seven day weight loss challenge, to a 14 day or 28 days fitness regime, to a 12 week total body workout. You will lose the weight, but that's the easy part. Loosen and keeping off is different altogether. That's where I've come into. I know what's needed. I'm living proof that it can be done. Even though there's people out there saying it's impossible, it is possible. Don't let anyone ever tell you that it cannot be done. Look at what I've done. So in saying that, diets don't work. I hate diets because what they do is they take things away from you. They'll tell you what to do. They'll tell you how many points you need to have before you can eat your next food. They'll tell you how many calories to count so that way you know how much left you can eat. They also tell you what to eat and how to exercise and what not to do and what you can do. So what happens? You are governed by all these restrictions and rules when it comes to losing weight. But what if you start to be the boss and of being bossed about diets and you start to lose weight and lose weight for the very last time on your terms. So stop trying to lose weight by doing things that you can't do forever and start falling in love with a new lifestyle that you have chosen to adapt to, that you can do for the rest of your life. That sums it up. That is how I've been able to keep my 80 kilos off for the last 18 years. Yes, it took me 18 months to lose my weight. Just taking small steps and making small adjustments. I really ate the food that I still enjoy to eat, but I just watched my portion control. But what happens, as you lose losing weight, you love the way you feel, the way you look, the more energy you have, the more freedom it gives you. 
And then you take more note in what you're doing and start to enjoy different ways of doing things. There is no point in eating food if you hate it. There is no point in doing exercise, or I like to call it activity, if you don't enjoy it. If you don't enjoy going to the gym, don't go. If you don't like eating broccoli, don't eat it. If you don't like running, don't run. Find something that works, that you enjoy, that you love, that you can do on autopilot without hating it, that you'll love it and look forward to doing it. That is the secret to losing weight for the very last time. There's no pills, there's no potions, there's no special food that has super in front of it, there's no crazy, silly workouts or exercise regime that will get you there as well. It's all about you. It's all about you loving your new lifestyle that you can see yourself doing for the rest of your life. And for me, that really happened on day one. What made this different from all the other diet attempts that I did for 20 years? Well, this time I just stopped and I paused. And I said to myself, well, I cannot keep on doing these New Year's resolutions every year that I want to exercise better and eat better and lose weight and not keep it off the rest of my life. What do I need to do differently this time that I haven't done before? So I chose to do things differently and I chose to do things from day one that I would eat food I enjoy, I would move the way I would enjoy and by sticking to that and then making some adjustments along the way I found I was able to stick to it. Diets don't work because they're restrictive, they take things away from you and they're hard to stick to because it is something that you don't really enjoy doing. That's what it comes down to. So my message today, this video's purpose, is to avoid diets in 2021, to lose weight for the very last time, stop trying to lose weight by doing things that you can't do forever, and start losing weight and adapt to a lifestyle by choosing food that you enjoy to eat, by doing activities that you really enjoy. And to adapt to it and to do that for the rest of your life, and you'll be an autopilot, and that's how you build these new habits. And you start to enjoy the way you feel, the way you look, the way you do things. So block out those companies and diet companies telling you what to do, and start doing things on your terms. And be the boss, instead of being bossed by them. And that way you have total control on how you move, what you eat, how you think, how you lose weight, but most importantly, how you keep weight off for the very last time. I'm really excited to share with you what I've been doing for the last 18 years, because I know it's going to work against all odds against what people have said or companies have said or professionals have said when it comes to losing weight for the very last time you must take control because food isn't the enemy exercise is not the enemy it's our choices when we make better choices and better decisions when we stop and we pause and we take a deep breath in which I forget to do then you think and see things a lot clearer. And then you understand, no, wait, this is what I'm going to do. I'm gonna take control. I'm gonna eat the food I enjoy. Let's watch my portion size and cut off the sugar. I'm gonna move and do activities which I can enjoy, incorporate those movements within my day that fits within my lifestyle, that fits within my job, my family, that doesn't take things away from me because we still need to enjoy life, life and we need to live our best lives and enjoy what we do 
because that will make the big difference when it comes to losing weight for the very last time. And nobody would teach you this because the weight loss industry and diet companies want you to become dependent on them for their products. And you know that it's not long term, but you get these results. And my other take home message is that you need to be patient. I get it. You want to get rid of the weight straight away. I was there. I know that because you're just sick of having it. But let's do things differently in 2021 and say no to diets and say yes to losing weight for the very last time and stop trying to lose weight by doing things you can't do forever and start losing weight by falling in love with a lifestyle that you can adapt, food that you love to eat, movement which you love to do for the rest of your life. My name is Silvestro, the Weight Loss King. I hope this video has given you a different perspective on losing weight for the very last time. If you enjoyed it, please like, please subscribe, tell your family, tell the world that losing weight for the very last time comes down to you it comes down to you falling in love with your lifestyle and things that you can do forever. Once again, thank you for watching and I'll see you at my next video. No wonder we hate diets because we just don't want to do them, they're just crazy. So, <laughs> no, I'm not going to, I'm not down. I just hate dives and 